Reverend Virgil Caldwell, speaking for the Black Coalition, says the city commission tried to pacify the black community by offering to rename the area of 9th Street from Chestnut to Riverfront Parkway, Martin Luther King Plaza. But the coalition has not accepted the city's offer. In fact, the group plans to rename the street without the commission's seal of approval, if need be. All those citizens who support the name change are asked to attend a meeting at Miller Park this Saturday at noon for the street's dedication ceremonies. If anyone feels that this is out of our jurisdiction, if anyone feels that it is unlawful, we don't feel that it is, it is any more unlawful than it is for one man to tell the city commission what it can and what it cannot do. Caldwell admits the legal and political repercussions of the group's action have not been ironed out, but this has not weakened the Black Coalition's commitment to the cause. We will be prepared to accept any consequences that might evolve from this. The street change has become an issue for black leaders because they believe Chattanooga youth need symbols of hope and progress for which to strive. Caldwell says Martin Luther King Jr. symbolized these values, and by blocking the renaming of 9th Street, the city commission, in effect, is standing in the way of black progress. Now it has become a matter of principle. Not only do we need the symbol, but I think black people need to stand for something. And when they make a uh, request, which was certainly a proper request, I think it needs to be honored by the city fathers. So Reverend Caldwell emphasized the group is prepared to go to any length to see 9th Street renamed. And he asked that those citizens interested in the same cause to attend the city commission meeting Tuesday morning. Pat Jarrett, TV12, Tri-State Report.